Hello there and welcome to another tutorial from AKCP. Today we're going to be taking a look at the AC voltage sensor uh, inside the Security Probe web interface. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. As you can see on Intelligent Sensor port number 2 I have the icon for the AC voltage. Uh, so I'll go ahead and we'll click it. And here are our basic options for our AC voltage. You can see we have the uh, sensor name AC voltage port 2. Uh, you can delete this and uh, type in uh, your own title so we could put AC voltage um, in office uh, computer. Uh, once you've done that uh, you can go ahead and you can click save just to save the new sensor name. Okay, uh, You can see we have the status which is normal and you have the online status right below that. It would either display online or offline. We can then go into the advanced mode options. Uh, you can enable the graph, you can toggle that on or off. You can assign the sensor a uh, website, a URL, by typing in this box here. And you can open that link in either the current window or a new window within the map interface. Uh, below that we have the continuous time for the sensor to be in a new status before accepting the new status. So for example, if the uh, sensor goes into a high critical status for, uh, let's say, 5 seconds, uh, once it's been in that status of 5 seconds, it will then display a high critical status. It means it would need to hit that 5 second mark before it would display that high critical status. The same for the normal and also for the sensor error. And then finally at the, at the bottom you have the enable calendar. You can toggle that on or off. Select the days in the week and the hours in the day in which you would like to have this uh, sensor report or not report. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Uh, go ahead and click save wait for the page to load up. As you can see all of our settings have been saved and that's all there is to it. Very, very